Hello, I'm Judy Reese, the Elephant Whisperer. I'd like to tell you about the power switch. This is a way of diverting someone's attention away from a problem and towards what they want instead. If you've been involved in any sort of personal development stuff, any sort of goal setting thing, you'll know how challenging this can sometimes be. You can see that someone's completely focused on the problem and you know that if only you could shift their attention to what they would like, they'd have a much better chance of getting it. But that's not always an easy thing to do. They keep on going towards the problem, towards the problem. And it's like watching a train crash in slow motion as you know that their attention is going there. Because they're going to get that and not what they want instead. So with the power switch, you divert their attention. It's like switching them from one railway track to another, just in time to avert disaster and set them off on a whole new direction towards what they want instead. It works very simply. You listen as they describe the problem and then you ask this question. And when their problem, in their words, what would you like to have happen? Let me show you. But turning that from abstract thought into something that somebody's actually going to read and understand, uh, let alone enjoy, is what defeats me nine mm. times out of ten. Uh, yeah. And sometimes it defeats you. And when it defeats you, what would you like to have happen? I wouldn't like it to defeat me at all. But I, I, yeah, I, I wanted to be able to go and just find a different, a different approach mm -hmm. uh, to get across whatever it is that I'm, I'm trying to get across. Mm -hmm. So ask the question. Mm -hmm. um, some, sometimes I start with a question, mm -hmm. and then in the process of writing, I answer it and go, "Oh, that's kind of pointless, then, wasn't it?" <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. And it's kind of pointless. What would you like to have happen? I'd like to be able to find a way of, of describing the process of writing it out to discover my answer. So there it is. That's the power switch. And when? Problem. In their words. What would you like to have happen? Try it out. Let me know how it goes for you. What happens when you do divert someone's attention to what they would like instead of the problem? In the next day or two, I'll be putting up the next video, which is all about the power of metaphor. It's one of my, my pet subjects. It's something I love to talk about and I really look forward to sharing that material with you. See you soon.